Sachs. He's the former bass player of Duran Duran and the star of the new film Sugar Town. Look, I didn't father any ch child on that tour. Yeah? You so sure? Yeah, I'm sure. And how are you so sure? Because on that tour, I made it a point of only getting... Yeah? Yeah. I did want him to vote. This is John Taylor. <laughs> Sounded very rude. What's that? It sounded very rude like that, didn't it? Yeah, didn't it? you were bleep. You were, Those uh, bleeps were in so just the right place. It sounds. Is that how the. The rocks. You play a rock star there. Yeah, an English rock star actually, who's, who's known better days. Yeah, uh, a, a aging rock star. Well, aren't we all? Yes. Yeah, aging at least. Um, and why did you turn to acting? Well, actually, acting turned to me. They just came to you. They came knocking. <laughs> well, the, 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 there are two directors and writers on this film. Alison Anders is one of them, and she's been a friend of mine for seven years or more, and. Uh, she called me last summer and said, I want you to be in my next film. I've written this part. He's you. Um, and you're, we're going to have a lot of fun. And did you enjoy it? I did, yeah. You got to swear? And, 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 oh, uh, I got to say things I, I, I can never say at home. But you, when you were... <laughs> can we talk Duran Duran, the glory years? Oh, yeah. I mean, you guys in the 80s were bigger than the flock of seagulls. I mean, you guys... Which wasn't. <laughs> you guys... Only for a minute, though. But you... you did you have a favorite Duran Duran song? A favorite song? Um, well, it, it's funny, I was listening to your preamble, and I, I used to like making out to, to Rio. Oh, did you? Yeah, God, especially. I used, to, I used to put the drum intro on, you know, so it would repeat and repeat. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, now, can, can we talk about the, were there some wild times? Uh, well, yeah. Uh, anyway, it's called Sugar Town, and uh, it's. Uh... Uh, what about uh, what about it got out of control in Italy one one night? You do. Oh, that, that the exclusive anecdote. Do I get the? Uh... Yeah, yeah. This was this was what year was this? In... Eighty four, and uh, we no eighty actually later eighty six eighty seven. We weren't really selling any records anywhere, sort of, you know. Um, significant. Right. So we used to go to a lot of, we used to go to Italy and tour a lot there. And uh, Italy's very, uh, it's almost a police state at times. And there was, uh, we, we were playing at a f f soccer stadium in a town called Bari, which is on the north coast. And the, uh, there'd been some political machinations going on. The Lord Mayor had been replaced the day before the concert, and he said, I'm not letting this concert take place. You know, this is a sacred uh, sports stadium. And then Sacred the, sports stadium. Or something. Wow. Something like that. I, I, they can have soccer look, and I'm, hooligans in there, but they I'm, can't uh, have a band. Okay. You know, I'm fleshing this out right. a little. Uh, right. And uh, the, the concert did end up taking place, but he wouldn't let the crowd onto the, the field. He, mm -hmm. he said they had to stay in the bleachers. Well, when we went out, it was a really oh, horrible day. It was raining and thundery, and uh, but on on the uh, on the grass in front of the stage was just every policeman from the area and the carabinieri in, in Italy. They 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 model their uh, outfits on the SS, and they all carry um, machine guns, and uh, so they and they've all brought their girlfriends along, or the girlfriends have said, "No, we have to go because oh, you know we want to see Duran Duran." So you know you have for every one girl who's like. Fe you know, looking adoringly. There's a, there's a, you know, a a policeman. Yeah. You know, look, you know, just fuming, steam coming. That's out. hard to get phone numbers that way, isn't it? It wasn't easy. With the, uh... it wasn't easy. In fact, I coined a joke. Oh, can you say coined a joke? Yeah, uh, yeah, you can. Uh, <laughs> say, on the seventh day, God said to the Italians, "You can either have a brain or a uniform, but you have to choose." Oh, that's okay. You like that? Yeah. That's, <laughs> so these guys were not the brightest guys in the world. And what that's happened not. after the concert? What did they do? Did they, did oh, they we got we got the hell out of there. You got out of there. Yeah. And and did uh, now Duran Duran still tours? They do. But you're not a part of that. Right. Why is that? Uh, well, I I'd done it since for 20 years, 20 years almost. And uh, here they are. All right there this they is, are. This is this is there what this is. Roger, Nick, Simon, Andy, and the other guy. Now this is uh, this is I should know this stuff, but this this is uh, which one? This is you? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh, like, I don't know that difference. Which which one are you? I'm this guy. Yeah, that's what I thought. You're, yeah, you're the you're the uh, you and Simon were the uh, the good looking guys. I, I'm the one sort of the reluctant one, always at the back. You know, always right. at the back. Not really. How is how is Simon doing? Because he's Simon's he, great. Man. He's he isn't he kind of mm. odd? No, no, no. He's <laughs> he's the. Uh, He's the easiest one, actually. He, he, I hear more more people come up to me and say, "Oh, uh, the, w with gruesome stories about him." But actually, he's he, he's he's a sweetheart. Uh, we 